So hi there again everyone, this is again Alan and welcome back to my channel. Today I have decided to paint again another floral study, so this is gonna be the fourth. And for this study I have chosen to paint roses in a vase in loose style. I don't have an exact reference image for this but I remember seeing on Instagram a few weeks ago this beautiful loose painting. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to uh, to save the name of the artist or even a screenshot of the painting but I hope this time I'd be able to translate or express or make my own version of that effectively and um, to those who are new to my channel of course for my floral studies I am using the Phoenix watercolor pad this is an inexpensive watercolor pad it's around 300 Philippine pesos and this is 190 grams 8K in size. I've been using this since my uh, floral study number one. I also use this in my uh, landscape study. So this is my first floral study, my second, and my third. So as you can see, I'm more into realistic style. So this time, I would want a loose style. So let's do this. So earlier, I did this sketch using my... Uh, HB pencil and um, my target here in this painting is to finish this in around 10 to 15 minutes I would also try to avoid speaking so that you can just concentrate on the process and if you have questions you can just comment it down and I'll be answering it right away so I believe we are ready to start the paints that I've chosen to use here are Mgram watercolors and the colors are pyrrole red nickel quinacridone gold Hooker's Green, Burns Sienna, and Ultramarine Blue.
So now we are just doing some finishing touches. And actually, this is my problem with myself. Whenever I paint, I find it hard to end. You know, to end my painting, I find it hard to stop. <laughs> but yeah, that's just me. And uh, we're almost done. I'm just gonna be. Uh, Killing some hard edges. Let's just add some drops to uh, make it look more loose a bit. Uh, what do you call this? So I think we are done with our floral study number four, our loose watercolor painting of a uh, Roses in vase. So you know, it's my first time to uh, make a loose floral painting, and um, I know I still need to learn a lot and improve on many aspects. But for now, I am happy with uh, what I was able to achieve. Yes, I need to stop. Okay, I'm happy, and I hope you also got something from this study, and I hope. For those who are not subscribed yet, please do subscribe. If you have questions or comments or criticisms, whatever, please just put it in the comment box and I will be responding right away again. Thank you and see you next week.